I'm going to sit down and do my Gerard Cosmetics unboxing for you guys. So that's what I'm going to do. I do have some huge news that I want to share with you guys, but I cannot share it yet. So you'll just have to tune in um, either tomorrow or Tuesday. I'll be doing another live to tell you guys my big news because I'm super excited. And I love sharing stuff with you guys because you're always just so encouraging and it honestly means the world to me. So, yeah. Um, as a bunch of you know, I've had a code with Gerard Cosmetics for a while when they started their affiliate program. And I decided not to promote my code because I personally, as excited as I was to work with the brand, I hadn't really tried too many things from the brand and I didn't want to false advertise. So I waited. Um, I finally got my PR package in the mail, which I'm super excited about. So um, first, I think it's really cute that it comes. I just realized I'm using my front camera, so this is reverse. My bad, guys. <laughs> my bad, guys. But, um... Yeah, the boxes come with a note already in them, which I thought was just super, super cute. Um, I did get a few things in my box. There was a few things I really wanted to try, and I'm super, super, super excited to talk about them. So, naturally, I got the Slay All Day setting spray. Um, I chose the scent Lavender. I really like the way lavender stuff smells, and I was kind of iffy about trying anything else. And... So, I got it. It's purple. Um, I haven't tried it yet, but I will be trying it soon. I think, I wish I could film a review video for you guys, but I might have to do a review live just because I'm still working on getting a new camera and new laptop, which I should have, hopefully, by the end of December. I believe that's what I'm going to do. I'm speaking it into existence. I'm going to have the things that I need for my channel to get right back on track um, by the end of the summer. So I got this and I do just want to personally say thank you to Jen. I feel like it became a trend. Um, a lot of bigger companies were saying, oh, we're going to look at smaller influencers and all of that stuff. And then they weren't following through. Jen followed through. She's super interactive. She's super encouraging. And I really appreciate getting this chance with Gerard Cosmetics. So yeah, that's all I have to say right now. Um, but I did get the Slay All Day. I wonder what it smells like. I mean, I know it smells like lavender, but I wonder if it really smells like lavender. Ooh. Ooh. That smells really good. Okay, hold up. That smells really good. Ooh. I'm excited. I'm excited. I think the packaging is so cute. I'm a sucker. Everybody knows I love gold. Gold is like my thing. Um, So the black and gold packaging really does it up for me. Really loving it. Okay, what else did I get? Um, I did get, I think I got two lip pencils, so we'll talk about those. I got a lip pencil in Sugar and Spice. Yeah. Oh, these are so pretty. And this is like a brown tone liner. Well, it's what I think of when I see Spice, which is really cute. I actually really like this. I feel like all I have are like brown, like super dark brown liners. So that's a nice switch up. And this was, was it Sugar and Spice? I think that's what it's called. Did I make that up? No, I didn't. It's really called Sugar and Spice, guys. So it's this color right here. And that's going to be so pretty. I'm actually going to be wearing this stuff this week. Um, Say bye to this wig, y'all. I'm actually going to be going wigless for a while. Um, and I get my hair, my real hair, done on Tuesday. And it's going to be pretty neutral, so I'm going to be able to, like, really play around with looks and stuff. Because I don't have to worry about them matching my hair and all of that. I really like this liner. This liner, it feels really smooth. I like smooth feeling liners. So that's another one for me. I'm excited to, like, really try this stuff. Throughout the week, I'm hoping I'll be able to get up some looks. I've been super busy. I was supposed to, um upload some looks this week and I just couldn't get around to it. It was such a busy week for me and I really could not make the time to do a look. Um, normally I stay up and do my looks and I just couldn't even do that either because I was having to get up early every single day and it was just really complicated. So I do have another lip liner. This one is called Underground and when I think of this color I think of um, Stone by MAC. I feel like this would be a really nice, yeah. A really nice lip liner to go with stone super nice they're so creamy I love like creamy lip liners I don't really like dry lip liners I have sensitive lips so 
if a liner is too rough I literally get like a reaction like my lips will break out and it's the most frustrating thing so creamy formulas are awesome I'm super excited to try these I'm definitely gonna be showing off um what else did I get I think those are the only lip liners I got wait what's this yeah those are the only lip liners I got so I also got I got two glitter lipsticks. I got Hollywood Boulevard, which is, I actually don't know what this color is. We're gonna see. Ooh. My ring light makes me look like a dead person, y'all, when I don't have on makeup. This is tragic. I swear I don't look this rough. Um, th This looks pretty. I'm gonna, oh, this would be pretty with sugar and spice. Okay, wait a second. Can y'all see that? Do y'all see the reflection? Ooh. Oh, that's gonna be so pretty, especially if I do it with spice. It's gonna be so cute. Oh, I'm loving it. I really wanted to try their glitter lipsticks just because it's not like straight glitter. There's actually glitter in the lipstick and I was like, that could be nice, especially with the holidays coming. I'm gonna be doing some holiday looks for you guys. Um. Depending on how quick I can correct this camera and laptop situation, I might even film them for you guys. So that was the glitter lipstick in Hollywood Boulevard, which is super pretty, super, super pretty. And then I also got, ooh, feisty. I got another glitter lipstick in the color DM me. Don't DM me, guys. It's like, nah, I'm nice. Y'all can DM me. But um, it's this... I guess purple tone color and I'm gonna swatch that on my hand too Ooh, I really love purple I wouldn't say it's my favorite color but it is like I love like purple makeup and stuff so that is the purple one which I think I could do a cute little ombre lip with um, underground which is the darker liner and then DM me in the middle which would be really cute for another holiday look I have a bunch of holiday looks in mind for you guys, but they're not just like regular, like every day. I really am branching more into the editorial side, uh, the artsy side of makeup, which I'm super excited about. I feel like um, until this year, I didn't really have the bravery, I'll say, to kind of step out of my box and take chances with my looks. But I've been trying it lately and it's going pretty well. But I really do like these glitter lipsticks. I don't know if I'll wear them often, depending on how they feel on my lips, but if they're comfortable on the lips, then I'll definitely wear them. Um, what is this? I got a lipstick called Kimchi Doll. And I want to say this was a nude. Yes, it's like a peachy nude. So I wear a lot of nudes. Um... <laughs> actually have so many nudes it's quite sad but I feel like I don't have every shade of nude yet so I'm gonna keep going um oh it's sheer too it's pretty though it feels like it would be nice on the lips I could also match this with sugar and spice I feel like that would be really neat too I'm excited to try these lipsticks out because they just feel so nice on my hand. So I feel like they're going to feel magical on my lips. But I don't do swatch videos because I'm not good at them. Or I guess I won't say swatch videos, but like try on videos where I'm like constantly putting on my lipstick and stuff. Because it just takes too much time. I'm not good. Like I feel like that's my struggle point on my face more than anything. I have so much trouble with the lip products. So I like just don't do stuff like that. I tried to film like a try on lip gloss video one time and it was horrific very bad actually so that was kimchi doll in their lipstick and i have ooh, a hydra matte long wear and this is in the color bear it all sounds like it's another nude guys and it is oh and it's pretty um i don't really wear liquid lipstick anymore i don't know why i don't i just kind of stopped but this, oh, this looks so pretty. Hold on. Ooh. 
Okay. Y'all, we're in business with these lip products. This stuff is looking good. So that swatch right there is Bare It All. It's not, I mean, I guess you could class it as a nude, but it's not super nudey. Like, it's not peachy like Kimchi Doll is. Ooh, y'all, a lip combination to die for would definitely be the Sugar and Spice Lip Liner, um, the Bare It All Liquid Lipstick, and then... I can't remember what this glitter one was, but <laughs> that glitter one right there. I think that would be a cute lip combo. I think that would be a really cute lip combo. That's a pretty color. I like colors like that. I feel like my nudes are like all super nudes. I want something a little more chill. Ooh, and I got, this is a Supreme Lip Cream. And this is in the color Angel Cake. I love that their packaging involves so much gold. Like, it's literally making my life. And this is like a peachy tone nude, too. I think this would be cute. I could do this with a sugar and spice lip liner. Um, I could put Bare It All, or not Bare It All, um, Kimchi Doll over the sugar and spice liner. And then use this as a gloss. I think this is really pretty i'm really into nude lips like that's always pretty much been my thing i don't really do colored lips i wish i did but oftentimes i put on a colored lip and i'm like this is a lot and then i take it off and i do a nude so um i just again want to say thank you to jen so much so grateful for the opportunity to work with gerard cosmetics and everything um and i'm just very grateful i'm gonna show you guys my box so thank you so much for watching my little unboxing. I appreciate it. And don't forget that when you shop Gerard Cosmetics, when you shop Gerard Cosmetics, you can use my code GLOWYK, G-L-O-W-Y-K. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Appreciate it. Appreciate all the support that you give to me. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, and you, and you, and you, and everybody out there.